People saying being a fan of Transformers is being happy 24-7. No, because not only Transformers 1 cost 119 million globally, which is what people consider flopping compared to what is expected or should have been, or what the numbers would be in terms of definitely getting a sequel and being called a success. So would you agree that Transformers 1 is the best movie ever to be considered a flop? Like, you know, there's movies like Joker 2 that's playing in theaters right now that that one's underperforming and also being considered a flop. And just compared to all of the movies that were considered a flop, is this one the best ever? Not only Transformers 1 releasing on digital platforms this Tuesday, October 22nd, which I literally mentioned in the video before this, which doesn't help with the movie still being in theaters. So go watch in theaters. And for the people who for some reason can't go to the theaters or just don't go to the theaters at all, be ready to watch this movie on digital. It'll be worth it. This doesn't help. Transformers 1 was removed from an additional 589 theaters this week. Ah! And Venom The Last Dance is gonna release in like five days, which I'm definitely looking forward to that movie, but it's not gonna help Transformers 1 and with the re-release of Godzilla Minus 1 on November 1st, from now until the end of its theatrical run, there's a very slim chance this movie will gain a lot in the numbers. Would you look at that? The other robot movie is doing well. If only Transformers 1 can be doing the same. And this movie was already greenlit for The Wild Robot 2 for a second movie, a sequel. Which that one, I think when they first announced it, passed at like 150 million. If only Transformers 1 could do the same. But not only am I going to watch this movie again this coming week, but the man himself is recommending you to watch this movie. Batman says watch Transformers 1. Yeah! Yeah, Batman knows what's good!